Mount your Fujifilm GFX to the back of a view camera with our 4x5 GFX stretch stitching adapter. This adapter from PhotoDeox allows you to turn your Fuji GFX camera into a digital back for any 4x5 view camera with a graph lock back. Just mount the GFX camera on the adapter, mount the adapter to a 4x5 view camera, then use the stitching guides to slide the camera back and forth, capturing multiple photos to stitch together and post for a final large format image. Here's how to use the 4x5 GFX stretch. Start by using the included hex key to loosen the flange distance adjustment screw at the top of the adapter. For GFX cameras with a hand grip, you'll need to loosen this screw, extend the camera mount tube all the way out, and retighten the screw. If your GFX camera doesn't have a hand grip, you can leave this tube unextended. Next, mount your GFX camera onto the adapter by lining up the mounting dots, pressing the adapter and camera together, and rotating the adapter to lock it to the camera. Place the adapter on the rear of a 4x5 view camera that has a graph lock back, slide in the two graph lock locking tabs on the top and bottom to lock the adapter to the view camera, and you're ready to shoot. To shoot through the center of the view camera's lens, slide the adapter plate so the top white dot lines up with the center white dot on the adapter, and tighten the adapter's silver locking screw. To shoot a multi-photo stitched image, use one of the three stitching mode guides detailed on the adapter. Before we create a stitched image with this adapter, you'll need to set up your camera for best results. Set your ISO and shutter speed to manual settings, and set your white balance from auto to a white balance setting that suits your scene. If you use auto settings when stitching, the multiple images you capture may have different exposures and color balances that won't stitch together as well. Once you have your GFX camera ready, set your view camera's aperture and focus. To set up your view camera's framing, slide the GFX camera back and forth on the adapter to see the boundaries of your shot. We don't recommend using your view camera's ground glass to frame or focus because the adapter offsets the focal plane and crops in the framing, so using the ground glass won't give you accurate results. To use the 76 by 33 millimeter stitching mode, rotate the camera to landscape orientation on the adapter. Line up the top white dot with the left red dot and take a photo. Slide to the right red dot and take a second photo. Import these two photos into Photoshop or another photo editing app of your choice and use Photo Merge to stitch them together into a final 76 by 33 millimeter image. To use the 96 by 33 millimeter stitching mode, make sure the camera is rotated to landscape orientation on the adapter. Line up the top white dot with the left white dot and take a photo. Slide to the middle white dot and take a second photo. Then slide to the right white dot and take a third photo. Import these three photos into Photoshop and use Photo Merge to stitch them together into a final 96 by 33 millimeter image. To use the 85 by 43 millimeter stitching mode, rotate the GFX camera to portrait orientation on the adapter. Line up the top white dot with the left white dot and take a photo. Slide to the middle white dot and take a second photo. Then slide to the right white dot and take a third photo. Import these three photos into your photo editing app and use Photo Merge to stitch them together into a final 85 by 43 millimeter image. Here are a few technical notes. When creating stitched images with this adapter, make sure your subject matter is relatively still. If it's not, the multiple photos you capture may not stitch together as well. One way to address this problem is to blur movement in your scene with long exposure times. Your 4x5 view camera must utilize a graph lock rear standard mount to work with this adapter. Without a graph lock rear standard mount, you won't be able to use this adapter on your view camera. View camera lenses that require the lens to be very close to the film plane for infinity focus may not focus to infinity when used with this adapter. This is because the adapter recesses the focal plane of your GFX camera behind where the camera's normal focal plane is normally located. A good rule of thumb, if you have to almost entirely close your view camera's bellows to get a lens to focus to infinity, it most likely won't focus to infinity with this adapter. Unfortunately, this adapter will not work on field cameras like the Graflex Speed or Crown Graphic due to focus issues. And when mounted on a field camera, our 4x5 adapter will only give you extreme macro focusing with the field camera's lens. This is why we don't recommend using our 4x5 adapters with 4x5 field cameras, and only recommend using them on view cameras that give you more flexible focus control.
Our 4x5 GFX stretch stitching adapter is a great way to digitize your 4x5 view camera. Click the link in the description below to learn more about this 4x5 adapter, as well as the other 4x5 adapters PhotoDeox offers. And comment below if you have any questions, we'd love to help you out. Also, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this one. Thanks for watching.